two seconds. All right. Hey everybody, what's up? Julie27 here, bringing you more Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. If you were wondering about the two seconds things, that's your uh, <laughs> intro. That's just so that I can line up the audio and the video properly. Just, just so you know. Continuity. It's not just for suckers anymore. Boxes. Why there's empty boxes here, don't ask me. Apparently continuity still is for suckers. I'm gonna dive off just because I feel like it. And I missed. Go! Oh, I missed. Ah, I made that joke in the last episode. So apparently we need to warp. Now, as we heard from the Zoras in the. What the? There's no one here! Oh, the Zoras. Okay. You Zoras making it so I can't do things. Grr. Okay, can I warp now? Of course not. What was that? I don't know, but it was entertaining. All right, the Upper Zora River. Yeah, a little odd that you can only warp when there's nobody else around. However, as we learned from the Zoras in the last episode, the Prince is actually very good at catching the fish that the monster seems to like. So, we're going to go talk to the Prince and see if we can get maybe some fishing tips, or maybe if he actually has some with him, I don't know. But, nevertheless, it'll probably be helpful. And just because I miss Epona so much... How you doing, girl? I'm sorry I left you standing outside Castle Town for like three months. Now I'm gonna leave you standing here for three months. Hey. Okay, so we need to find the prince. Malomart. Um. Welcome to Malomart. I've heard from a reliable source that shops in Hyrule Castle Town are gouging prices, crushing folks under the thumb of commerce. Fear not, brother, for Mallow Mart has, supposed, has proposed a townspeople relief plan as an answer to the lamentations of the common man. Hey, it's just like America today! Phase 1, repair the broken bridge leading to West Castle Town to the field in order to improve traffic. Phase 2, buy that Castle Town shop and sell products to the town at reduced prices. You have heard me right, brother. There is a problem, however. The finances for the executors of this gorgeous plan are lacking. Please, Baroda, offer some financial support to aid the purchase of the Castle Town shop for the benefit of the people. I don't have money. So I'm just going to leave. And plus, hey, the guy in uh, Castle Town who gives me absolutely nothing for my money is much more useful than you are. He's got to be in one of these buildings. Perhaps he's in the hotel. <laughs> oh, Link, I heard from the shaman that Eileen might be able to get her memory back. Yeah, and the Zora boy opened his eyes. Thought those were both pretty good things, but Eileen and the Zora boy is still pretty... Yeah, okay. Human syntax for the win. All right, well, let's go see uh, Ilya and the Zora boy. Where are they? Oh, come on! Okay, well, where in the holy mother of crap nuggets did they go? Did they go?
What the? Dropped a letter into the hot spring and now I can't read it. Gotta blow this thing. Creepy postman. Okay. Well, obviously our main mission right now is to find the Zora boy. I've already wasted five and a half minutes doing this. Is he in this? That's the barn. That's the bomb shop. Where is the boy? Is he in here? What is this? Oh sweet, I caught an ant. Bug fans love that golden color. Caught a bug like this, so let's let this one go. You suck. Oh well, at least it gave me a heart. Okay, so there's a bug. Goody. And I'm sure that those other bugs I've been carrying with me for who knows how long certainly aren't dead by now. Okay, but seriously, where is the Zora boy? That's Malomart. Um, is he in here? This building? This is the only real place I haven't looked yet, so... Logic would denote he probably is. Oh... Where's the door? Here we are. Uh, greetings. I felt Isla could use a change of scenery, so we came here. Who knows if she gets out and sees daily life? Perhaps something will jog her memory. Link, perhaps you can keep her in your thoughts? Sure. Oh, Link. You've gone through so much trouble for me. I'm so sorry. Colin and the others have told me so much about you, Link. They told me that you're brave and kind and you heard very well. That means you must be a good rider, huh? Oh, and the name of your horse is Epona, right? Yes, it is. Epona! What a lovely... Oh, you tease, Nintendo. You tease. Uh, where is the Zora boy? I need to find him. Is he in the back? Or perhaps I just come out the other side of the frickin' building. <sighs> Why is it such a chore just to find one little fish boy? Sword boy had gotten better, but he's been really depressed lately. He doesn't try to make a uh, He just goes straight to... Oh, okay. Alright, alright. So he's in the graveyard. Okay, I thought he would be, you know, resting or trying to get better. Pfft, silly me. Oh, Zora boy, where are you? Ah! Creepy noises. I don't even want to know what that is. I don't... I do not want to know. So something tells me he would be over here by his mother's grave. Something tells me there's going to be a really sad, really emotional scene here. Oh. Is your name Link? My mother came to me in a dream. She showed me your image. She spoke of a youth who would save our domain and steer my fate, one named Link. I must thank you for all that you've done. If there is anything I can ever do for you, please tell me. Please. I'm a Nintendo protagonist. I can't speak. Link, I have so little confidence. What can I do? I could not even carry out one simple task for my mother. I'm so unlike her. I doubt I'm even qualified to rule. Dude! Oh wait, here, look at this. You suck. Here, look at this. 
The Beast Man of the Snowy Mountain, perhaps? But one more important thing is this red fish he's holding. It must be a reek fish. That's a rare specimen found only in the Zora village. It feeds on a valuable type of coral, and without that bait, even our best fishers cannot catch one. Look closely, Link. My earring is made of this coral. I would like to give it to you. Alright. Shape of a fish hook, and it's lovely. So add it to your hook for your fishing rod. With this, you can now catch reek fish. I received it from my mother. But it's fine. I no longer need it. As I look to you, I get a sense that... Yeah. <clears throat> Leave it to me to ruin a dramatic moment. As I look at you, I get a sense of what my mother wanted. What I should be doing now. I will return to my village. The reek fish can be found near the mother and child rocks in the waterfall basin. The fish are red, so I think that you should be able to spot them. And so, after that really touching and dramatic moment... LET'S GO FISHING! Yeah! Okay, I'm sorry, I had to do that. However, with that, I'd say we're pretty good to end this episode off here. So, next time on Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, we will be going back to Zora's Domain in the Waterfall Basin to catch us some reek fish. And hopefully attract the monster so that we can KILL IT! So, thank you guys so much for watching my videos. Be sure to leave me some likes and comments and whatnot if you enjoy watching my stuff. Thank you for watching and viewing and loving me so very much. Have a nice day. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.